Hi, I'm Aaron Luna. I'm from Spain and I am a concept artist. Now I'm working on, a, on the industry for a year. Here I am with my sketchbook and Janos to show you some tips for practicing and for improve your uh, drawing skills. So when I'm studying, uh, I'm thinking about a structure and shapes, um, how, uh, for example, regarding the face, uh, how all the features work, like the nose, for example, you know. And it's good to look for different references and different faces to build a great visual library. And don't be afraid of uh, being wrong or doing things in the in a wrong way because that's to learning. You know, it's good for the learning that practicing and uh, making mistakes uh, makes the good art. And I spend like one hour, two hours doing this, like looking for the reference that I want. Um, and I want to understand all the structure. For example, here you can see how all these uh, net is uh, sticking to the face and how the shapes works. That is good for understanding uh, shape language of the faces and the, the structure. Trying to make some stylization to uh, to your to your style, your own personal style. You know, like it's it's kind of uh, a good practice to try to understand the structure, trying to to give your touch to your studies, not only just drawing. But you can draw too. Uh, for the sake of drawing because it's a good practice you know sometimes we have the, like a art block but we are thinking oh well, i don't know what to draw i don't know what to do just study you know like draw for the sake of drawing that is a good point because you're going to improve faster and it's not all about the te technique it's about having fun doing it you know like technique is important and having uh, like a good principle sense is a a good a good practice but the thing is to to have fun uh, you know like looking for different things and uh, understanding different things of the world you know like it's the same for everything for example anatomy faces maybe vehicles you know for vehicles is the same you have to understand the shapes you have to understand the structure and having fun you know like taking reality as inspiration and then you can do it uh, your own way so for example in this page i just did like um, a study from a, a pilot helmet and then trying to translate those shapes to a mandalorian helmet to like doing new things you know mixing is uh, a good way to to understand and to learn you know like taking notes and making yourself uh, questions about your characters your props or environments or creatures is good too because concept art and almost every draw that we we could do is uh, all about design and thinking you know the thought process is important for for designing so I think it's important to, to take notes don't be afraid to write down things here and uh, meanwhile you're drawing like uh, making you questions that's important thinking about the proportions too this is a question for you it's like oh, what I want uh, this to to feel you know what what feeling I wanted to to transmit so try to keep it clean for me is important because it makes me uh, be more methodic you know like mm, not as a classic fine art study but more like oh I want to be like um, focused on shapes and things like that and the understanding of the things uh, should be uh, right you know like if your pages are clean it's good but the, if they are messy are, are good too it's a way of, of expression at least you know like um, it's good to um, study to the big mean and small range of the things you know like for example props uh, or anatomy for example animals have those patterns too you know like studying the proportions big medium small ratio and the shapes and how it works you know how a, a plain shape could be translated to a volume one thing so it's important to, to try to look for these things meanwhile of course or having fun you know uh, for me the point is that it's a uh, the sketchbook is for having fun. You don't have to care about if it is wrong or if it's right. Uh, you know, it's like, um, I think that I made a lot of mistakes here, but, you know, I don't care. It's like more, oh, I'm having fun. And it, this is uh, like, uh, you know, like a chat guy posing. is like, oh, fun, man. I can feel the struggle of this guy in the, in the anatomy, you know, um, and things like that. So that's about the process, you know, and then you can translate all these things to your own designs. Uh, I think that's important.
um, like for sure this practice develop like muscle memory and that's important too because when you are drawing from imagination it's all about muscle memory and to visual library and then you don't have to stay thinking about oh how this muscle works or where is this go it's like oh yeah i know how anatomy works i'm going to get focused on design you know uh, for animals it's the same you know you can also study things that you love for example i'm a huge fan of the batman universe and i think it's a good way to study like you know function of, um it's important in design so i think it's, it's worth it to study those things because then you are going to understand how these things uh works and then you can translate it to your own designs you know like um taking these notes, how it works, and looking for different references, different suits, different armors, yeah, it could make it like um, better for you and for your understanding of the world. So if you try to understand it the best way that you can, then you're going to improve yourself so fast. You know, like understanding is for me is everything. Like I, I want to know how everything works and how the shapes uh, move around the uh, the volume, um, how can I play with the proportions, how can I play with the uh, structure, and then stylize it, and make it more fun, you know, for example, armor uh, are a complex thing to study, but they are so fun, when you understand how the work is so fun, you know, like, oh my god, I can do whatever I want with this, uh, I can do my own uh, knights, my own um, armor creatures, or whatever you want. Not so fun, you know, animals too for creatures. You have to make our uh, relations um, between uh, fun and drawing. Like motivation is not always there. It's a thing that it's going to be uh, out of you like a bunch of times. So you have to to keep yourself like, oh, this is fun. I love to do this. You know, like, that's the point. That's that's the thing to to having fun doing these things. You know, like and the most you understand, the most you are getting getting fun so for sure also weapons how they work how they are done you know like uh, looking at black, black blacksmith videos uh, if you want to understand how this character works you can look at references of other stories games or, or movies you know like uh, for sure uh, like um just start drawing and poses are important too um uh, you have to look for interesting references dynamic you know like not start with the three quarter um pose um, kind of boring thing just try to understand also the values and uh, how it works with the with the light the structure you know it's important too and don't be afraid of yeah you know, again like uh, to your mistakes yeah uh, it's not important thing the important thing is just to understand things you know like clothing um textures a structure again you know like the more you understand, the more you're going to have fun, you know. You can get messy too, you, you, you could have a bad day or whatever, and you don't want to be like organized, so you want to just draw and you don't care about the space and you don't care about anything, yes. Drawing, you know, whatever it is. I think we are lucky or, of having such um, a thing like drawing in our life, uh, because we can uh, work with this and we can uh, enjoy our work for a life, you know. So that's so important too, um, because um, for me th this make me, makes me happy. You know, this is what I want to do uh, all the day, drawing all day. For, of course, you have to have a balance with your life. This is the path to getting better, to improve ourselves, to do things right. So we we have to care about this the most. You know, like we are drawing in our sketchbook not other artists sketchbook this is important for us you know this is our soul our thing you know like it's important to to realize that we are studying a lot of things but we can study for example in these pages armors and then we could translate to our own designs and do our thing you know like uh, for sure i studied uh, like a bunch of faces uh, a lot of armors and then oh i'm going to take these together and make this this character and see what it came from it and more studies you know it's like all about understanding all about having fun maybe uh, 100 faces is like a lot but maybe you can start with uh, 10 or 20 something like that you know uh, and then you can uh, develop your skills and then you can increase the 
quantity of faces that you are drawing, armors, characters, you know, that's the thing. Like, uh, sword, time, uh, you know, like, goals. That's, that's pretty important because it, it will build your motivation, you know, like, and draw everything, like, everything you see, everything you, you like, you know, draw it and make your, your uh, research, you know, like, learn about it, how these things are built, how these things are done, you know, it's important too. You can study uh, also value structure here, like uh, understanding the planes and how to separate them, whatever you want, you know, it's like, that, that's important too, to be uh, versatile, you know. Furries too, you can study furries, um, <laughs> whatever uh, your friends may say, it, it, it's cool too to, to understand these things and how you can uh, make uh, an animal look like more human. It's interesting, you know, like for sure anatomy is important and uh, different types of body, you know, like the chat guy or, or like the beautiful girl with the perfect body, yes? understand how body works like there are a bunch of different bodies that you want to study and you want to use in your character design and fun that's the thing you know like make yourself uh, some challenges uh, don't get so um, in your comfort zone because you are not going to learn so much you have to get out of it and and having fun with that you know for example uh, here I have some even a Munson studies and then I have like uh, an uh, Eva 001 from the Evangelion series, like to understand how this design things works, you know, like different designs, different things um, that makes your style up, you know, like then take your own approach to the things you study and try new things. Um, for sure, you know, like don't don't be afraid of mixed things or you know, like uh, understand old things. <laughs> make your color studies too, use different mediums they're, they're going to make you understand different things from, for, for example for me watercolor is a great media to understand how light works you know like uh, carving your shapes you know like that that's important too like for sure understanding like complex things like this how can you use the big medium uh, ratio on the knee uh, little studies are important so big thanks uh, you want to share where people can find you no oh, you can find me in artist station uh, looking for Aaron Luna and I am also on Instagram uh, that you know so will uh, serve to you so thanks a lot guys hope this motivates you a lot and see ya